Hello and welcome to a quick tutorial on how to use the close till function on your till front. Firstly, head to the hamburger menu in the top left, go to admin and close till. So this is your end of day page. Let's take a look at the separated sections and find out what they do. Starting in the top left is your device name, followed by who opened the till, on what date and at what time. Moving down the screen is a checklist, and this will tell you if you have any open orders or open tables if you are in the hospitality industry. Moving towards the top of the screen will show us how many transactions we've done during the day, how much money we've counted during this process, our takings for the day, the listed float, and a total variance. Coming to the bottom of the screen is a float section. This will show us details about our float and if any petty cash movements have been made during the day. Now the cash up panel is going to be the main section that we're working in. As we can see from the left, we have our tenders, a counted column, an expected column, and a variance column. All we need to do is enter in our tender totals. So for cash, here I'm putting 100 pounds more than expected as we have a 100 pound float. For the card tender, if you have an integrated card machine, you can just copy the figure that's listed in the expected column and pop it into the counted column. If you don't have an integrated card machine, you'll just need to run your X or Z reports to find that total. The last step is to press the print and close button on the left hand side. This prints your end of day report. Once you've confirmed that it's printed correctly, press close and this will take you back to your sign in screen.